I don't even know who he is anymore! What? What? You're crazy! So Ellie thinks that this is the right thing for me. Okay, guys, I think that we need to have a talk. I am so in love with Jared. He... He has always been there for me. He's always been there for my family. If something comes up, he is there to help. He is so good at his calling at church. Everybody loves that he's energetic and he's playful with the kids. And he just has the perfect personality and the biggest heart. And he's always willing to put others before himself. But I have been noticing some changes with Jared lately and I've been keeping my eye on him. And I feel like these changes that he's been making is not true to himself. and is really not true to us. I'm in Jared's office and I've noticed that this is where most of his changes have been happening. And I just opened up his fridge and no Dr. Pepper. Zero calories, no sugar, no artificial sweeteners. What is this? I'm not even sure that I like these changes because it's not the Jared that I know and it's starting to make me worried. We have had four cases of Dr. Pepper for weeks and they haven't even moved. I don't even know who he is anymore! Jared has changed so much. I don't even like looking at his clothes anymore. All of his free, free stupid t-shirts, I want them gone. These pants, he has had these pants for four or five years. He used to wear them every day in sales. I want them gone. All of them. I just want you to look nice. I am not even mad. He deserves this. He's been changing right in front of me and I'm throwing all of these out. These are going. Goodbye. <laughs> In all seriousness, I love Jared. I adore Jared and he has been making changes. Just small, simple changes lead to huge changes and I have seen that with Jared. He has been working out in the mornings. He's been waking up early, getting videos, getting work done. He's been trying to eat better. I just can see a huge difference in Jared and I'm very proud of him. But I will say it is true, a lot of the shirts that he wears is like the free t-shirts that he's got and he even himself wants to like vamp up. And I want to treat him to a day of just Jared. Let's go shopping. I want, I'm gonna give you tons of clothes to try on. Even if you normally wouldn't wear those clothes, I want him just to have a day where it's me and him. We're gonna go to lunch, we're gonna go shopping. And I love Jared and I'm proud of him. So with that said, Shall we go? I am proud of you. Thank you. I am proud. Well, the other day, so I've been doing really good at drinking water, and the other day I was like, we should go to Swig and get a cookie and a drink. You were having a craving. And so we went and got a drink, and we pulled away, and I was like, where's your drink? And he's like, I didn't get one. I was like, what? What? You're crazy. I skipped out on Swig. I know. It's like the craziest thing I've ever done. You guys know I love Swig and Dr. Pepper and all that stuff, but by small and simple things, some great things come to pass, right? Yeah, yeah. you look really different with do I? the lighting. Oh, not <laughs> Where do you want to start, Jared? Oh, probably the beginning. That seems like a very good place okay, to start. let's go. So Ellie thinks that this is the right thing for me, and I am going to go along with it. But <laughs> Whatever, you are just as happy. I mean, Shorts, pants, we'll see. We'll just have to see how this looks. Are you guys ready for a little fashion show? Starting me. I'm short. I don't get it. Why are shirts like this is a sweater? Why does it only go to my my belt? Like if I wash this, like that is not flattering at all. No one wants to see this. But well, why do companies do this? Like, I'm short, and this is a medium. I don't get it. Am I missing something here? Like, am I missing something? It's the story of our lives. It's not even a good one. <laughs> Progress! Hey.
<laughs> you look I like crisp. I like this a lot, Ellie. Well, you look ravishing. Woohoo! I look pretty good. Yeah. I think these are a little too wide at the bottom. Ready for church. Yeah. But I like it. Crazy, huh? Mm -hmm. Four months. I like still can't believe you're pregnant. <laughs> Kids are so fun to shop for. <laughs> and Jared. <laughs> oh, thank you. If you guys want to smell like a baby's bottom, Tom Ford. Even the sales associate agrees. It's like baby powder <laughs> No. Hey, here's a trophy. You earned it. Or would you rather have the bulge? <laughs> Pellet has been cleansed. Get scratching and sniffing. This is good. It's my favorite. Smoothie. Like it? I do. Okay, so today is actually a very special day, not just because of what Ellie and I did earlier, but because today is the two year anniversary of my parents living in Utah. And it's a very exciting night and it's something that they actually invited us to dinner to. And they told us while we were in Salt Lake, we are wearing nice clothing. So just an FYI. Ellie already looks amazing with her like coat and sweater and everything. Good thing we just bought you clothes. And we just bought me clothes. So I am in the back seat and I'm looking through all the clothes this that I just nice. got. This sweater right there, uh -huh. that looks nice with that jacket. And I've got some slacks. I've got these slacks I'm gonna wear. So I hope mom and dad are okay with this because I probably would have dressed nicer had I known. But we're about to go into a very <laughs> sweet dinner with my mom and dad. It's snowing like crazy right now. You can't really what? tell. It's like, man, time climactic, but it's snowing a lot. All right, before we get any further in this dinner, dad has some rules about the table that we're gonna Every go. Every electronics go Yeah, my that. watch just went off. What are the other rules, dad? Phones off. Yes. And you can have whatever on the menu you want. Oh my gosh. Anything. Anything. <laughs> Anything. So that's including like food. <laughs> we can get whatever food we want. Of course. Okay, all right. No unlimited amount of Dr. Pepper. <sighs> Don't worry, I've been doing good with that, haven't I? <laughs> I know I haven't been loyal. I feel like I have missed you all day, my sweet penny girl. You have been such a good girl. And I feel like I've missed you guys. I haven't been really a huge part. Well, I guess a huge part, but I haven't talked to you today. And I feel like that's been missing. But I just wanted to say how much I enjoyed today. Ellie and I are trying to work hard on doing a date night once a week. And I feel like today totally counts for that. Especially that we were able to get to spend some time with my parents. And this has been two years since they moved to Utah. I cannot believe that over two years ago, we went to Spokane and helped them move here. Like that blows my mind because it feels like it was just yesterday, especially all of the siblings getting together and saying goodbye to our house that we grew up in. It was so cool. I love that my parents are here. I feel like they're our neighbors and I love that our kids, Jackson and Calvin, love that grandma and grandpa are here. That's the coolest thing to me. And I'm so grateful that they're here and I'm so grateful that they have enjoyed living next to us because I don't know, maybe sometimes we're not the greatest neighbors in the whole entire world. Maybe we are, I don't know. We'll let them be the judge of that. Today was a great day. Cheers. Cheers. Let's go to bed and watch a show. Absolutely. Ending our night, the best way that we know how was a little flash. No, not that kind of flash, Ellie, don't. Like a little, you know, Barry Allen, the fastest man alive. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. And we will see you guys next time. What the? Where are all my free t-shirts?